Hello, how's it going? Salt Tire here. Uh, this is part four of my Roma Serectum 3 Let's Play campaign as Pergamon on hard and very hard difficulty. Previously, we finished off what I think was the last of the Ionian Free People's Army. Uh, we tracked them down to the eastern border here and defeated them in a battle. And I've since sent um, Eumenes and this army back up to Pergamon and we're having some of the units retrained in there. Um, there's some that we can get retrained right enough, like uh, these friggin heavy cavalry and the friggin Dorifaroi. Um, I think they have to go back to Gordium. In fact, I'm pretty sure they do because this is the friggin area. If I just right click, you can see Frigia. So they'll get retrained in Gordium once they have, we have the appropriate barracks here for them. Uh, also, well, it's these um, three of for all. Now they have to go to uh, Assos here to get retrained. Uh, but now I'm getting off yes, movement. And it's the same with the um, yes, Slingers. I'll just merge sir. this unit with that one, then we'll send the other one back. And I think that's it, really. Oh, the Thury of Roy Hippies. I think they can be retained in Assos as well, can't they? Yeah, they can. So, let's see. Maybe we can just send them back now. Yeah, we can. There's enough movement now. And if we've got enough money, we'll get them retrained. Don't know if there is right enough. Let's see. Yep, let's yeah, get them brought up to full strength. And then that's that done. Um, now then, moving on to the end turn. Oh, before we do, rather, let's send um, we'll spy up and we'll have a look at Nicomedia. Because I want to try and take this settlement as soon as we can. 52% chance of getting in. I won't risk that. Not in this mod. You'll get killed, I think. And don't have an awful lot in there. There's a few got silver chevron of um, experience and a couple got triple bronze. Yeah, can't see what these other ones have got. And they've got Prissus the first as a family member. And Crikey, he's a one, two, three, four, five, a ten star general. Crikey, that's quite good. That's, in fact, that's very good. Especially this early in the campaign. Um, I think we could take that, but I want to. We'll wait, we need to wait till the Lithobolos is built. Uh, here we go. I think that takes three tons for Lithobolos. Yeah. I we'll need to wait till that's built anywhere, else it'll just uh, generate the garrison script in there. Uh, the thing is, of course, they might reinforce it by the time we get the Lithobolos ready anyway. So we'll just need to move along um, steadily and just see what happens as we progress. Okay, let's hit that um, end turn, see what happens. I dare say that Gordon will probably get visited by those um, Galatian um, rebels, if not the GCS themselves. Greek city states, not that one anymore in there. Uh, they've got another unit there, Chaldean Mountaineers, just been added. Okay, now then, um, let me see. Let's send these Thuria Feroi and these Sir. Greek Slingers Sir. to Assos. The and we'll have them retrained. I think we'll get another unit of three of Faroi. They're quite useful flankers. We can't get really go for the elite units yet because we need to get our finances in shape first. And um, I also want to get this um, foundry built, this large foundry built in Pergamon. We've got enough money for it now, although it takes up everything we've got. 12,000 denarii. We've got 12,700. So we'll get that built, because that will give us silver upgrades to our weapons, armour and shields. And um, I think that will prove quite important in the shape of things to come. Um, now then, 755. Yeah, 
we don't build much for that, can we? Let's see if we build something. Gordon's building. Sardis. Not really a lot we can do. Uh, we might as well put that first aid center in there, I think. Read it in use. Let's just do a recruitment report. Structure report. Flaterus has got a sloppy scrade. Minus one to management, minus 10% bonus, no trade income. And I'll need to shift that one to a, a general. It's in the field, then I think. Flaterus is in here. I'm going to bring Athenaeus out of there and we're going to put him in Sardis, I think. Hot headed. Procrastinate. We'll put him in Sardis. Because that's going to be a military hub. I won't put him in an economic settlement. Fill a tear or a sloppy scribe. Orders. Put yes, your knees in for now and then the we'll pass that sloppy scribe onto him. And then we'll bring him back Orders. out to lead his army. Let's bring My these Lord. hippies out, they'll be useful. Move out. Around, forward. <coughs> around here. My lord, my lord. Uh, these yes, hot lights. Yes, Just in case. Yes, Stratigos. Yes, Stratigos. Yes, Stratigos. My lord, leaving the army. Uh, For death, sir, leaving the army. Sir. Two of them, let's build this army up. Send these out of here and we'll put them in. That's us, I think. I want to get rid of these guys. Don't use them. Alright, they'll be retrained, they'll join back up with the army again. And let's just keep them, keep them all close together and we'll move on to the end term. Ah, damn you. Alright then, what are you going to do with that? So another look at Nicomedia. Yes, master. And they've got another unit of uh, allied phalangites. Okay. Get these boys out. Number three units there, but... Reach them just now with what we've got, right enough. My lord, forward! Oh, we can't now. <laughs> right then, not to worry. Yes, Let's get these um, Greek heavy peltas in there for retraining as well. Okay, not to worry. We'll get a bit closer, March. but they'll probably run away now, because larger I'm approaching them. Sir. Send that unit of Vector Moy back March. to Pergamum, I have them retrained. And we better start looking at recruiting some new units as well. Um, and also, let's have a look at this family tree. Endios is 15, so he'll come away soon. And he can go into Gordium probably. Uh, 
but it's still leaves us wanting another one for um, Ephesus. All right, build time. Let's have a look. Uh, starting with South D, so I want regional focus in here. Now I've got a governor in there. Ephesus, we want again, I'm going to put it in until we've got a governor. Probably orders 105. Improve things a little bit, we'll put that in there. And Ephesus and Assos. Don't need that yet, I think. 165, the public order there. So we'll put the wine and trade in. That gives us a little growth bonus of 0.5%. And tax income bonus of 13% there, so that'll be useful. Okay, construction, there we're done. Can't build in Gordon because it's under siege. Alright then, I think that'll do for now. What can we, well we can't recruit anybody there anyway. Um, Get these soldiers out as well into the army. Right, that's him. Got his garrison. They're retraining, and then he'll have his garrison as well. I think. No, I won't recruit a, a general just yet. I'll, just, I'll wait for the time being. See what happens here. Let's move on. stayed. Oh, I think maybe that's because we never got close enough. Um, notice that the Ptolemaic army is a, a, making another incursion on our territory. And um, I think, I've got a feeling that the games try to encourage me to attack these because we put us at war with them. And um, the Ptolemaics are quite strong in, the, in this. But they're, they're at war with the Slickers at the minute. But um, if we move over onto their territory, there you get the little transgression window. So I don't know how we get a transgression window with them. Um, Pergamum's got the ballista ready, so that's good. The stone floor. I, I think I called it Lithobolos earlier. My mistake. Theory of Faroya retrained, so we can soon get this army up to full strength. Ephesus, uh, Governor's Palace, let's get that in there then. And Sardis, let's get population growth there, let's get that up over that 6,000, then we can get better buildings. I think that'll do it for now. Uh, in Pergamon, Let's recruit another, uh, get another stone floor built, ready for our sieges, and Stop. let's go and have a little battle with these guys here. Prepare for battle. Victory! Attack! Uh, Quaker, look at the upgrades these have got, uh, sorry, the experience these have got. Two double chevrons of silver. Experience 5, jeez, oh. their upgrade's only bronze right enough, but, um, you know, we'll, we'll defeat them all right, but, uh, but they're still put up a good fight, I would think, um, even if it's only three units, still gets me a bit miffed off right enough that the AI gets these silver chevrons of experience and the like, at this early in the campaign, and I can't bloody get them, <laughs> but I uh, can nah, makes it. I suppose it makes it a bit more interesting. Can't make it too easy, can they? I shouldn't have to use all my troops here. We'll just pick out Take what we up need. Take the spear and shield. Put on your helmet. Put aside the fear in your heart. And remember that you are the sons of great soldiers. And now, to arms! 
Let us harden our hearts and think of better days. Those days will come! Okay, let's go and have a look see where it could possibly be. Any high ground? Not really. A little bit to the right there. Up here maybe. Nothing much up there. A little bit up there. Nothing at all. The chances are I might just be straight in front of us. Okay. Um, who should we use? We'll take three units of uh, our best hot lights, I think. And we'll flank them with the Agera Speedies, because they're pretty useful. And um, the Thuria Furoi as well. And we'll put our slingers over here. I'm going to flank them a bit. Use them just to try and speed the battle up a little bit by getting them round behind, around the flank at least. And um, the rest of them. Uh, I can just all stay back here. Obviously, take Yumanese for the morale. Uh, oh, here we'll put these um, Jav Cab wide as well. Again, just use them to speed up. That's we'll need a unit of cav just to run down routers, I suppose. Okay. I think I should do it. Take them off fire at will. Well, do Let's just get at them up for a minute. Let's find out where they are. Hmm, oh, they're over here. Okay. Triple speed. Move them up there a bit quicker. Take them back off group now, I think. Bring their hot lights up into their face. So we'll send these uh, Agarus Beeries up here on the flank. Uh, we'll send the Jav Cav up here. Come on, fire at will. Whip them down a little bit. Again, it's the same with the slingers, we're getting them over there. Jab cab into these boys here. Okay, he's swingers running up the top. Oh, it's looking quite good. If we bring our jab cab across here, put him on fire at will. These two units in there on fire at will. Bring the slingers up to here. Little morale boost from the general. And then don't look as if they're going to fire at will. So I'll we'll have to do it manually again. Attack! 
Just so whip them down a bit. Let's try sling us into the back of them. They don't seem to be flying either, so. Shouldn't take too long, I don't think. They've run out. Let's see, we'll just leave them up and pick up any routes, I suppose. A heavy cavalry unit. We'll bring them in a bit closer as well. They look like they're ready to break. Yeah, they're breaking already. Yeah, yeah, they're gone. Stop firing slingers. Let a jar of cover on them down. Job done there. Where are we getting on here, boys? Struggling just a wee bit. Three units on to one you think they'd run riot, wouldn't you? Alright, all morale boost from the general. These are a bad boy uh, outfit, these um, Agar Speedies here, aren't they? Look. Facing the wrong way, guys. Alright, turn your attention to them, and we'll get these hot weights around behind them. Take them off guard mode. Let them charge in. Take these stereo for all back over here out of the way. I'm going to take the Agar Speedies off guard mode as well. Let's get this over there. I think that's him, they're away now. 
Alright General, you can go and get yourself a few kills, run them down. He should be breaking that. Great God be praised! The enemy general is killed! Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts! The enemy show their true there virtue! They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits running from our men! And, uh, let's give her Sister Feroy. Oh, there's only one guy to run down, but you might as well have him. So you took part in the battle as well, so uh, it's only fair. God be praised! This victory is surely their work, not that of mortals like us. Okay, we've taken 75 casualties. Uh, we get 15, 16 of them back, so we're in about 60 casualties. Those upgrades and um, um, experience as well, silver experience and silver upgrades to weapons and that they can make such a difference to you. Bloody when I was a battle, I've noticed in many an occasion. Uh, well, we won that one, okay. Let's have a look at Nicomedia. Uh, they're filling out, alright. It's this outside. We could still. Oh, I don't know if we could take them or not, you know. Give me these. Gets itself another. Oh no, it's a friggin' heavy cavalry if you want them. It's 6,000 a pop, I don't think I'll bother. Okay, right, so we've got a, uh, we can get Gordium building now. Um, 90%, let's get that in there. Drop the taxes down. We want to get that to 6,000 as well because we want to get a governor in there and we'll let me see. We'll get them uh, regional focus in there and start getting that moving quickly. My lord. Send you up there, in fact. Sir. Send both these Your units dad. up there. Yeah, a little bit more orderly. Well, we're not going to go and attack Nicomedia yet. Yeah, and need to come back here. And uh, we'll pick up the Little Balos. And then we'll have a look at them again. But it's going to take us two turns to reach Nicomedia. They could have reinforced quite considerably by, by then. But, um, even this will be hard to overcome, even with the full army that I've got. Probably need some archers for there. Um, we can't get them yet because we've got another... Uh, I keep calling them Lithobolos, but they're stone throwing siege ballistas. Don't get the Lithobolos till later. But, uh, we've got... Look at this, we can get a Gemma Elite. Uh, phalangites and uh, basilicoid peltastae as well and uh, royal hypaspistae as well crikey so we can get some good troops but the cost of them is quite considerable over four thousand over four and a half thousand for each of them so um, yeah we're going to need a bit of money after that uh, to get that them I mean but uh, that will come in time, no doubt. So we'll leave this here. I'll thank you for watching and uh, see you in the next episode.